Okay, let's get dark for a second. What if humanity decided to skip pizza, tacos, and ice cream and just eat each other? Could people actually survive on a diet of people? Here's the scenario. The world runs out of food. Farms, gone. Supermarkets, empty. Farms, gone. The only meat aisle left is, well, us. So if we turned into a species of cannibals, would that actually work? First, let's talk nutrition. Human meat isn't wildly different from beef or pork. It's mostly protein and fat. In theory, it could keep you alive, at least for a while. But there's a problem. There's only so much supply. The average adult body has about 125,000 calories. Sounds like a lot, right? That's enough to feed one person for about 60 days. But the second you eat someone, that's one less person producing more. Food. You're shrinking your population every meal. And if everyone's eating everyone, the numbers drop fast. Think of it like a very grim pyramid scheme, except instead of losing money, you're losing people. Within just a few generations, there wouldn't be enough humans left to keep the system going. AG people. Oh, and it gets worse. Eating human brains can spread a disease called Kuru, kind of like mad cow disease. It literally makes your brain turn to mush, so even if you avoided starving, your nervous system might give out. So here's the shocking part. If humanity tried to survive by only eating humans, the entire species would collapse in just a few years. We wouldn't be thriving. We'd be, well, extinct. Cannibalism might keep one person alive short-term, but it's not a long-term survival plan. If we ever run out of food, we'd be way better off farming bugs, seaweed, or even lab-grown meat. Basically, anything but each other. So what do you think? If humanity was desperate enough, would people actually try this? Let me know in the comments. And if you enjoyed this little dive into the dark side of what if, hit that like button and subscribe for more weird science questions.